everyone, my name is Penny. Today I'm here to tell you what Juno and Cancer wants in a relationship. Now these are very sentimental people. They like to have a long history with someone, even if that history is kind of dramatic and full of heartbreak and downtime where you both were apart from each other. But it's hard for them to let go of a memory. And they love a good romantic story. They want to be able to kind of create this fairy tale of you and them. And once they successfully have created that story, it's very difficult for them to let go of it. But they're kind of more likely to get attached to someone they have known a little bit longer or at least have had some connection with a little bit longer like oh maybe we met five years ago and went out like only once or so and then we get back together again and we meet up and that's when we really fall in love they're pretty into that kind of thing they love to feel like someone has somehow saved them from the life that they did not want whether it be um, like boredom, monoton monotony, some kind of financial hardship. Um, maybe they were dating someone else who was just abusive and awful and then their knight in shining armor came along. Or maybe they were just lacking a vision and they were lacking inspiration for the future. And then they met someone who, you know, made them want to put more effort into life. But I would say that all of them kind of have a hidden desire to have a family, even if it's not readily apparent and they might, you know, be kind of quiet about it. Because a lot of them, you know, depending on the rest of their chart, they really might not be all that traditional and they might not seem like the, you know, stereotypical mom or stereotypical dad, but that's why it's more of like a hidden desire for them. Anyway, I hope you liked the video. I hope it was helpful for you. And make sure you stay tuned for the rest of my Juno videos and check out my website if you're interested in a little more. www.penny-astrology.com Bye, guys.